And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got Champions League semi-final first leg action coming right up for you. It's Circle Bruges versus Varberg. Well, Derek, they don't come much bigger than this, do they? This will be a top-quality game between two of the best sides in Europe. Let's hope it lives up to its billing. Keep passing away. They could nudge in front. Save, but still a chance. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Oh, surely. And there it is. The first goal in the semi-final. A huge moment. Extraordinary scenes. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well-balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. One nil, then. Leonardo da Silva Lopes. Thibaut Sommers. Got attacking possibilities. Charles Van Oot. It's with Van der Bruggen. It should be! And he struck the post. Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Well, couldn't keep it. Corinne. Leonardo da Silva Lopes. Really good interception. Charles Van Oot. And on to Sommers. Van Oot. Making progress. Fine cross into the middle. Well, he was under a bit of pressure, but he'll feel he should have done a bit better with the header. Van der Bruggen. Leonardo da Silva Lopes. And a creative look about this. Will they get themselves level here? Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Now well, a good tackle. Could be dangerous. Couldn't keep the ball. 
Sommers. Well, nicely cut out. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, he hasn't quite had the impact. Hello, and I must say, it's always a real pleasure to be broadcasting from this part of the USA. We're at Lumen Field. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry, and delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's the United States against England. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Now they're on the scent of something positive. Now can she pick out a teammate? Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, that is how to run at defenders. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Nobs. Here's Kirby now. White. And giving it away. Crystal Dunn. Rapino. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And there we go. It is the ideal opening. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Fran Kirby. 
Now with Nobbs. Stanway. On to Nobbs. At times they make passing look easy. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Morgan. And Rapino. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And lining it up. And possibilities here. Can they convert? Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Nikita Paris. Nobbs. Fran Kirby. Stanway. On to Nobbs. And space for the cross. Oh, good looking run. No way through. Moving the ball nicely. Trying to carve out the equaliser. Well, the stats show us that the hosts haven't had that much of the ball, but their speed of attack when they win the ball back has been breathtaking. It's been a really good performance from them so far. Lindsay Horan. Did look as though they might be onto something for a second or so. Alan White. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Corner kick played in. Well, they'll try to keep the pressure on in the form of another corner. And there's the delivery. It comes to absolutely nothing. Dangerous looking attack. On to Haran. Rapino. Juliards. Alex Morgan. And Ertz, it might be, and it's gone in, just what the doctor ordered, things looking very bright for them now with this buffer. Just look at this again, the combination play in the top third of the field was so precise, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end, that's a good goal. And with that, the first half draws to a close.
nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And we have live action from the Cup to bring you. It's Argentinos Juniors, and they take on Western Sydney Wanderers. Well, there's nothing like a good cup run to boost confidence. And these two teams will be hoping this could be their year to win this tournament. Yes, there's a long way to go, but this is still a big game for both teams. Possession lost, intercepted. Dimitri Petratos. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Can they forge ahead? Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Sustained pressure, and now they have the ball. A danger here as he runs at them. That's fine play to keep control of the ball. Reniero. And snuffing out the danger. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Cuts it back. He's trying to create something. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. And the problem not completely solved. Danger averted for now. Avalos. Carbajal. Gabriel Avalos. In position. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Dimitri Petratos. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. McAllister. Carbajal. Now just couldn't keep the ball. Hemed. Petratos. Chance here, and he thwarted the attack with a masterful tackle. Carbajal. Well, he likes to run at them. This looks interesting. Can he do it? Still looking for space. That's all they can conjure for now. Steven Ugarkovic. Hemed. Well, can they open up the defence here? Well, he could really get at the opposition. Oh, a vital interception. Well, there you have it. In terms of possession, there's not much in it. It really has been a hard-fought battle so far. One of these teams needs to start taking a risk or two. Can he make it count? Pivotal moment defensively. And so it is. The first-half story has been written.
and real excitement in the air with good reason because it's the playoff final coming right up it's Real Salt Lake and they face the Colorado Rapids well Derek after months of hard work it comes down to this what great moments these are for the two sets of players there'll be nerves of course some players will be anxious some may even freeze but most I hope will be relishing the atmosphere and what lies ahead it should be a cracker Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. getting anxious when they have the ball an alert intervention Justin Merham losing possession a bit easily Now, what can they do from here? But really sticking to the task defensively. And back with Herrera. Ruiz. Herrera has it. Couldn't keep it. Trusty. Holt. Glad. Herrera. Here's Ruiz. Everton Luis. Justin Merham. tackling and very deftly cut out Merham well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory Everton Luis well, they keep working away, looking for passing lanes. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. Just wasn't a very good pass, finally. Well, can they be creative from here? K. Okay. Really nice ball. Well, the flag was up in good time, bringing that move to an end. Well, he's just got to be more patient there. He's gone too early. Merham. Now he must favour the cross. And the referee has given the corner. So many scope here for them to add to their lead.
And there's the delivery. And you need your defender to take charge. Pulls it back. Cross could be useful. Well, sadly, a bit of a tame effort, that one. And far too close to the goalkeeper. Bassett. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. The inside route looks promising. And still looking for space. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here it is again, and the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger, and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. That is that for the first half here. 